The Victorian branch of the ETU has about 19,000 members. The largest division of that is the apprenticeship section, which was about 2,000 apprentices we have as members now. Every three to four years, we have apprentice uh, EBA campaigns that come up, and that, uh, that 2,000 members largely come under the one, the one agreement, and that is the, uh, the vehicle that's made it uh, very successful apprentices to get uh, to higher rates of pay in the state. We have two sets of rates in the state of Victoria, the award rate, or the Enterprise Bargaining Agreement rate. We need to bridge the gap between award and NBA. The award rate is governed by NECA, the National Electrical Contractors Association, contracting award rate, or the Enterprise Bargaining Agreement rate, more commonly referred to as the EBA rate. We're in the middle of EBA discussions at the moment, and part of those discussions is to increase the relativity um, that an apprentice will get paid, and that's based on the trade rate. We now want to pursue 60, and that's a big difference, guys, right? The relativities have remained frozen for a number of years, and just an example of that, a first year apprentice would get 55% of the base trade rate. Um, we want to lift that to 65%, and so on and so on. I won't lie, like, the money. <laughs> the money is the big factor about that. With the ABA, I think anyone would probably say that, like, and plus the benefits. I'm on a union EBA. Probably 70% of the boys that I go TAFE with, they're just normal wages and when I hear what they get and I tell them what I get, they get shocked. Yeah, June 07 was when I started my apprenticeship and uh, I signed up at induction at my group training organisation. Um, straight away, almost double the award rate. The ETU apprentice rate in Victoria is roughly double the award rate or the non-union rate across all sectors. It's important without confusing you that there's also an adult apprentice rate for apprentices that commence their apprenticeship at the age of 25 or above. There is only adult apprentice rates for employers who have got a current enterprise bargaining agreement with the ETU. There are no adult apprentice rates in the award rate. Yeah, I've got to say, it's, it's definitely the way to go. Like, I enjoy working more on the EBA jobs than domestic. Probably any EBA sparky would say that.